Alright, what's up guys? It's Empire Gaming here, and uh, before I get into the video, uh, please go down there, hit that red subscribe button, leave a like, I want to see if we can get 5 likes on this video, um, and please comment that you subscribed, if you did subscribe, and I will try and reply. Uh, before we get into this video, um, down in the description, I will leave a link, or try to, a link to a friend's channel his name is uh little boy menace if you've already subscribed all right but if you're not go subscribe to him he does reaction videos uh reaction to pranks and music videos and all that uh he does challenges as well uh so go down in the, in the description and click that link if i can get it to work um if not it, his uh name will just be in the description uh but i'll try my best to get a actual link to his channel in the description. Uh, without further ado, let's get into uh, how it's made bacon. Alrighty. When it comes to breakfast, bacon is the order of the day, or at least the side order. Bacon's popularity actually goes back centuries when people bacon cured and yummy. smoked it in their own homes. But today, hmm. you simply have to go to the store and bring home the bacon. That is true. is now processed and even pre-cooked in factories where things mm. move along crisply they start with a load of pork bellies they toss mm. them around in a big tumbler and the action <laughs> softens them so it will be easier mm. to remove the skins cool. they place each pork belly skin side down on a conveyor belt takes the pork bellies to a long automated blade which slices the skin away from the meat. The skins drop onto another conveyor belt. They're on their way to being processed into pork rinds, a snack food. Cool. Meanwhile, Those are pork the meat are pieces nice. head in another direction towards a flipping device. It turns them back side up so workers down the line can trim off any remaining pieces of skin. Next, they make a brine solution to cure the pork. This involves funneling salt into a tank of water and mixing it thoroughly to dissolve the salt particles. They add liquid smoke and other flavorings to the curing solution. I never knew it took so long to make bacon. now pass under an injector head. It's equipped with numerous needles that repeatedly inject the curing solution into each pork belly. They press the prongs of a metal hanger called a comb into the pork bellies and hang them on a rack. Then it's into the drench cabinet for a shower in liquid smoke. As liquid smoke bombards the meat, it adds flavor and color to the surface. They transfer the pork bellies into a big oven. They spend about five hours in here cooking at a low temperature, which allows wow. the flavoring to permeate the meat. Five hours. <laughs> Now, it's into a blast freezer for a quick chill down, then into another cooler for a couple of days. The cooling firms oh, no. the meat, which makes it easier to slice. No wonder I'm addicted to... The pork bellies head to a sizing station, bacon. where knives trim all sides. They also pass under a metal detector here to confirm that pieces of the metal hanger haven't become lodged in the meat. That's After a that, lot of pork. they stack and wrap the pork bellies and store them in Good a freezer Lord, until they're ready to slice them into bacon. This is called the slice line. Here, they load the meat slabs into chutes. Shoots sway back and forth over a blade to slice the meat into bacon sized pieces. Mm. The bacon
Lincoln falls neatly onto a conveyor belt. Another conveyor belt rolls over the bacon slices. I want y'all to put down in the description how many slices of bacon do you think one of them uh, pork blocks makes? To secure them while they cook in a very long microwave. As the fat cooks off the bacon. I'd say they'd make mm, 500. Put your answer down in the script, or not the script, uh, down in the comments, I'm sorry. Put your, what, how many you think it makes down in the comments. Bacon, it drains into a trough. It will be used to make gravy and pet foods. The cooked bacon now exits the microwave oven and comes under the watchful eye of the inspector. She discards slices that are broken or not up to par. These wheels then roll the browned bacon slices onto parchment paper. A tiny electronic eye keeps track of the numbers. Finally, they stack the bacon for packaging. Now that's a job well done. Time to put the coffee on and scramble up some eggs. All right, guys. Well, that's uh, how it's made bacon. Again, uh, I'm assuming it five likes on this video. Um, please subscribe if you have not. Um, I'm wanting to hit 100 subscribers by August 1st. Um, and before you go, also check the description for my friend's uh, link. Um, I'm going to do my best. To get an actual link down there, um, but if not, I'll just leave his uh, name, his channel name, down in the uh, description. And uh, have a wonderful day.